Hello, I'm Dave Linehan. I'm the president and CEO of Ponce Health Sciences University. And today, I'm going to teach you how to tie a bow tie. I get asked this all the time. All the kids now, or at least a good chunk of the kids, are starting to wear bow ties. My sons, who are 17 and 18, when we go to, when we go to class events or we go to things like that, about 20% of the students now are wearing bow ties. There's some great advantages about wearing a bow tie. They, you don't spill spaghetti on your tie like I normally do. You lean over, you eat the spaghetti, your tie flops in there, and it's all of a sudden dirty. Doesn't happen with a bow tie. The bow tie looks stylish. You look good when you go out. People remember the bow tie. Think about this. 3% of the ties sold in the United States are bow ties, which means 97% of the people out in the real world are wearing normal ties. Only 3% of us are wearing bow ties. So when you wear a bow tie, People remember, you remember the crazy professor wearing a red bow tie giving you a lecture. It's very important to be remembered in life. So what we're going to do today, I'm going to teach you in six steps, five easy steps and one kind of difficult step and how to tie the bow tie. So here we go. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to actually take my jacket off here. So give me a second here. Just throw it off to the side there. That's very good. Now, obviously, if we're going to tie the bow tie, we've got to take the bow tie apart. And I'd say a lot of times, that when you start, your, your top button's unbuttoned. So you're getting in, you see somebody like this after a party or something like that, you think, well, how in the world did they tie this thing? So the first step, which really isn't a step, so I'm not going to count it in one of the five steps, is you have to button your top button. And I, I, I say that because I think it's kind of logical that you would have to do that, but my two idiot sons, when they were trying to tie the bow tie, they're like, Dad, this doesn't work. How in the world do you get it to do? They didn't have their top button buttoned. You have to button the top button. All right, so the first thing we do is we button the top button. Do that. So there we go. Our button's top. Now we have to take our collar and flip it up. Can't do it with your top, with your uh, collar down just too hard. And you get your bow tie. When you look at the bow tie, uh, who is this? This was made by Ravencroft out of London. So a good bow tie manufacturer if you happen to be in London. So Eddie and Ravencroft. But if you look here at the bow tie, you'll see a bunch of numbers there. What you do is you kind of adjust the tie to fit to your neck. So if you look here, there's a little clippy thing that comes out, and you can just set it to your neck size. That's important, and the reason why it's important, if it's too big, the bow tie looks like your bozo the clown. If it's too small, your little fingers can't get it just right. So they have kind of gauged it for you ahead of time. So I'm a bit, you know, I like things done a specific way, so I always make sure my numbers are faced up. So that's just how I do it. It doesn't really matter, but you take your bow tie, you go like this, you just put it around your neck. Start off, just start off like that, kind of, you know, so it fits there. Right, now, so it's not too hard. Then the first thing you know, I got a mic here. That's kind of an irritating thing. So if you hear my hands knuckling around on it, that's what's going on. You want to kind of set the tie so it's off a little bit. So I kind of set it just a little bit like this. So this corner here kind of fits right into the bump that fits right there. So you just do that. So I kind of step back so you guys can all see me just like that. Okay. Then what we do is we're going to tie it. So I'm going to take this top one, I'm going to cross it over so the long one's on top. Okay. If you look here, I'm going to step up a little bit closer so you can see. So here's the first step. Cross it over like this, take this part here, and just tie a little knot. So this, this long part's on top. So we get this right, the long part's on top. You're just going to push it underneath and up. And you're going to tie it. So there's your knot. You're going to take this end, and you're just going to throw it off to the side. Get it out of the way. If it's in your way, it's all kind of difficult to do. Take this, take your thumb, like Fonzie, right, from Happy Days. Put your thumb under there, come underneath, and form a nice little bow like this. So there is your bow. Let me get it. Everything's backwards when you do it on the screen like this, so it's not so hard in front of a mirror. You get it like that, then you take your thing back here, and you just bring it right over the top. So this is step two. Step two is you bring it straight down like that. Now you're probably hearing my hands muckling around on the mic. That won't happen when you're at home by yourself. So that's step two. Step three is you take your two ends of your bow and you bring them together. Okay? So you're going to hold it just like that. All right, so I'm going to go to the side here, hold it just like that, and you're going to take this and just give it a little tight. So that's step two, step three, excuse me, that's step three. Step four is you're going to take this part here, and if you look here, you've got a little hole right there, right? So you're going to take this and you're just going to push it through. This is the hard part, so this is kind of the difficult part. You're going to push it through the hole, and then you're going to take it and just straighten it out. So it looks like that. And you're going to take your edges and bring them down like that. That's step four. Okay. 
One of the things I like to do is this part right here. So you see this part right here? Sometimes it gets tangled up. So you want to just take a second before you tighten it up and just clean this up here. Like that. Okay. So there we go. So we got the tie. Now we just tighten it up. So we take the two parts with the loops. So the top one, the loop, and the back side on this side, and we just pull it like that. And it's going to get tight. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take the, the single ones, and you're just going to pull them out a little bit so they line up. And all of a sudden, voila. And five easy steps and one difficult step. You have a bow tie tie. You kind of go like that and fix it up. Now, a lot of times people like to do a six step. As I said, there's six steps. You can take the one where the one piece right here is in the front, and sometimes you can turn it 180 degrees so that you have your bow like that. So the bows, I don't actually do that. So here's the deal you tied the bow tie, it doesn't look perfect. You know, the people with the clip ons, everything looks perfect. That's okay. That's okay. The whole point of wearing a bow tie, along with getting the young ladies to kind of be interested in you, is that it looks a little bit off. It looks a little bit funky. If it looks a little bit funky, everybody knows you tied the bow tie yourself. You didn't cheat. You tied the bow tie yourself. You didn't use some clip on. And everyone likes a tied bow tie. I'm going to get a jacket here, so I'm just going to hold on one second, get my jacket. So with the bow tie on, like this, like this. You got the bow tie on. So not only are you cool with the young kids, you're cool with the elderly kids, you're cool with everybody. You got the bow tie. You're one of 3% of the United States wearing a bow tie. And here's the, less best, the, the best last part. You're out. You're out dancing all night. You've had a nice meal. Everything is moving around. What do you get to do at the end of the night? The people with a long tie, they kind of loosen it up. It looks stupid, right? It looks silly. But with the bow tie, what do you do? You grab the two single ends, you untie it a little bit, you open it up, you do the button, and you look cool. I'm Dr. Linehan. That's how you tie a bow tie.